pretty much all I needed. It was my skateboard wherever I went. It was like my tool to get into the scene. I just, you know, I just shred it up, shrop it out, chomp on the shred stick and get some serious action and tune it up, get sweet, you know. I don't drink and skate much anymore. Mostly because I skate in a day and I stopped day drinking about three weeks ago. Yeah, you know, I guess my girlfriend has been uh, my skateboard for the last 20 years of my life. Uh, I don't have much time for women, you know. I've pretty much been trying to live this dream of being a professional and getting sponsored and going to the contest and doing that. You know, it's pretty much just getting my welly check and skate and getting beer, you know, every once in a while. And using public transit and getting from one place to the next. I guess I always wanted to be a rapper too, you know, and keep practicing all the time. Everyone around me thinks I'm crazy, you know. It's, I guess because, you know, it's like how tough being, you know, a white rapper these these days after, you know, Eminem really pretty much took over. You can't come in here being a fucking toolkit, you know. You might get fucking clobbered or something, you know. People don't like it when you're fucking in a unit. You gotta fucking, you know, represent. And, whether you're fucking shred dog or not, it's more a personality, you know, like you gotta be kinda, you know, living on the edge a bit, and you're not so much of a pretty boy. And you know, and maybe that's my problem. If I had some kind of edge or attitude or style adjustment, you know, maybe something fucking people would take notice, you know. Okay, I'll just come up and I'll do a tail slide to revert around this corner. Hopefully I'll do an overcrow. Oh my foot slipped. Ah, oh, my head. <laughs> Where am I? How old am I? So Renee's still your girlfriend. Yeah. Renee, Renee uh, showed up at a park one day with her. Uncensored. What about when you stole my girlfriend? Again? All right. All right. <laughs> yeah. You right. better drop in. Hey, you're killing me. Man. Drop in at a depot. I'll give you 50 bucks. Girl, any girl here? You get Slayer? Like something real heavy. We need something because people are gonna get fucked up. People are getting fucked up here. dollars in my pocket, you asked for the last man standing. Get out of there, you already fallen! favorite old school bro. Oh, Tony Hawk. No, oh, there you go. What about oh, Kevin Stapp? He's got, he's consistent. Tony Hawk, though, he brought his own ramp this time. Kevin Stapp. Yeah. 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 Life is good. Thank you. Where's that C cap? Slam Uncensored. 
Welcome to Sealand Bowl in North Vancouver. You guys got five minutes. Starting now. Hey guy, I fancy I'd be a pretty shred dog surfer, you know, once I get out there I feel like I got all the moves. You know, I'm not in the best shape, I guess I could stand to lose a couple on the paunch area, but I've been, you know, having a good time with the boys. I have a hard time, you know, when people tell me that I should grow up because, you know, what, grow up into into being, you know, successful or, you know, doing something that I hate but I'm making good money and, you know, I'm just on a voyage right now. I'm just kind of feeling my way through the universe, you know, and hopefully I feel, uh, feel my way up onto that Slam City uh, stage and get to show the people really what I'm about. You know, show off the moves and kickstart your heart, eh? <laughs> That's a song. Right on. Yeah, look at the HMC! With the head crusher! It's time! It's time out! This is Jimbo Jack and you're watching Slam City uh, Gone Wild. Insane in the memory. Insane in the memory. Cool, 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 cool. Cool. We're bracing right now for what's going to be quite the deathmatch hockey game, skate hockey. We've got the Jacks versus uh, Alex Chalmers All-Stars. Basically, Steve, I'm going to crunch up can. That is used for uh, a punch. You're going to score you have full feet on your board, at least one feet touching the ground. That's where they're shooting from. Okay, we put the puck down. We both go for both ends. And we come up. What? So it's going to be a, a clean game? I don't know. That's how we do it up here in Canada. Uh, we're hoping we can get maybe a fight or something because this is Slam City Uncensored. And that's the way we do it. We get raw. We get real. Things are looking pretty heated. Uh, the Jacks are pretty serious. They already bribed me. The crowd's getting hot. We got a little fighting. We got a little skating. We got a little partying. We got a little drinking. We got a lot of love here. Slam 10, right, Jeff? What do you got to say about Slam 10? Slam 10, Renee. Renee, Renee. Get his album, too. That's right. All right, we're here at Slam City Jan 10. This is Slam Uncensored. Why don't we go check out some more tits, some chicks, slits, hot pants, 2003. Sign my boob. <laughs> All right, I, I think I can handle that. All right, let's see. Inside the club here, we're getting. Uh, there's a thong competition going on tonight. I've seen a lot of pretty girls. That's not one of them. So this is our uncensored uh, shot there. Yeah, there you go. What are some of the craziest places you've ever had sex? Oh my God. Maybe in a gondola. Where? In a gondola. We got Chris Sand up in the house. How you doing? Chris? What up, dog? What up? <laughs> He's getting wild. This is Double D from the Alva crew, man. So how are the days traveling with the Alva posse? We raised around. We're still going strong. Daggers. Daggers for life. So where's the best pussy in the world? What do you think? I don't know. Let's come back from Brazil. Pretty good there. 
What do you think about women skating? It fucking rocks, man. Do you skate right now? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So how much have you had to drink tonight? Oh fuck, like you, lots. What's your name? My name is Haru Hunter. Uh, I'm from New York City and I came out to Vancouver to enter the contest, blow shit up, get my 20 grand and bounce. So what can you do with 20 grand? I smoke a lot of pot, I drink a lot, a hell of a lot, and uh, sometimes mushroom, but nothing else. I bet you're about to go to will, and you're very beautiful, I'm in love with you, I love you. I love you. I love her! And a friend on the side too. Oh shit. Well, actually, I saw this cute girl I seen skateboarding the other day, you know, it's like, I didn't know so much about girl skateboarding, you know, kind of, I mean, I was always stoked, I mean, don't get me wrong, you know, all power to the ladies, you know, but, you know, they get wild and wicked on their own parts, you know, they do their own thing sometimes, so it's a little, you know, nerve-wracking, because, you know, you don't want them to hurt themselves, because they're just gentle, beautiful, precious creatures. You know, you don't want them to uh, to get too really up and like run on an organ or something. But you know, like the girls are getting pretty standard good. You know, like I mean, pretty. You know, I mean they don't shred like trout dog here, but <laughs> maybe they do. I don't know. I haven't seen it. I never, I always miss the girls contest at Slam, sorry girls, but hey. You know, that's the deal. You go there to see the bird. You know, girls are rad. You know, skateboarding, it's on TV so much, chicks are big skateboarders. Slam City on Sensor. What? Slam City on Sensor. No, fuck you. Let's talk about panty sniffing again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Just give us your expertise. Yeah, uh, uh, he is the okay. expert. Well, you know, I've been uh, working reefer for, uh, I guess, about 15, 15 years. Pretty heavy, you know. I gotta lay off it though, you know, because I can't remember like two days from yesterday, you know, it's like, I mean, dream time's great. I have a lot of, you know, fanciful dreams and a lot of, you know, spectacular things going on, you know, spheres and, and uh, vectors and all kind of weird, crazy, you know, lunar starships and... Uh... Now we're gonna check out some strangers, see what's going on tonight. How you like this event? Is it treating you right? And do you like Snoop Dogg? Good. It's fun. Well, you know, BC has some of the best weed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sure you've heard. Oh, yeah. Have you tried BC weed before? Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Woo. Well, wonder if we can hook you up. Hey, this guy. Hey, excuse me. <laughs> are, are you from Vancouver? Yes. Do you have any pot on you? I'm trying to look for some myself. Okay, well, when you find some, you tell them to come find me because these young ladies are from Calgary and they need to try some BC weed. Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> this is a documentary film show. It's uh, We're hoping to get it on the TV, so uh, it's going to be like a children's show for adults. Any suggestions? Uh, some Japanese girls. Did you score this weekend? Japanese love. I got lots of Japanese. I need some white girls. Slam City, bitch. This is Renee Renee here. We're at Slam 10. I'm with a uh, local boy, local hero, Jeff Dermer. What do you, you got to say about the contest this year, Jeff? 
Um, pretty good times. So what do you think about the ladies in Vancouver? You got a girlfriend right now? I do, I do. Oh, uh, why? It's great here because I don't know, so many ladies move here. How's the action been? You getting a lot of, you know, people coming up to you, like chicks going, hey, you're Jeff Dermer, you're in the finals. Uh, not really. You know, pretty much like skateboarding is a lot like sex, you know, you're just charging for it. You're waiting for like the, you know, the finale to do that big boost at Barley Trick and then, you know, it's like you shoot the moon, right? And you land it and it's just like gratification, you know? You may not get off, but you're getting off the ground, right? You're floating, flying through the air, you're doing your shit, you know, and that's good. I've never really been, uh, or anything. I don't know why, but I guess I just like the whole, you know, aspect of just skating and having fun and making people laugh and doing what I do. I guess just, you know, just the thought of seeing all my friends, you know, get, achieve that, you know, higher plateau of, you know, traveling and, you know, making money to do what I do, you know, do what I love and just gotta keep that dream alive, you know. The day I die. Skate or die. Totally, dude. That's awesome. Wicked. Boozing like hounds. You see this shit? Fucking pet. You want a fucking panty? Bill Danforth. And what brings you to Slam City Jam? Well, you guys had it nine years before this. This is the tenth year. I never made it yet, so I figured this was the time. Two complete one, two. Uh, last night I was uh, enjoying some of Vancouver's finest greenery and watching a movie and eating good food and thinking about all the pretty girls here. What happens at Slam City Uncensored? How's that work? So where did you go last night? Um, to the crack pipe. You know, space, you know, pretty much is the final frontier. You know, I, I can't wait to get a rocket board and, you know, leave my, leave my stoop and, you know, shoot off to the moon for a day for lunch, maybe bring a girl and get up there, you know. If I had a hoverboard, there'd be no problem with girls, you know. I'm gonna get a lot of girls, and always, you know, I'd be flashy. If you can only save up enough money to get that hoverboard, i would be able to pick up a lot of chicks. Yeah, I dream about girls a lot. You know, that's pretty much where I get a lot of my sexual, um, where I do a lot. Basically, you know, I have a lot of fun in my dreams with girls. Ah, oh, beautiful butt. We're getting wild and uncensored here. It's Slam City. I'm Renee Renee. And I'm making out with random girls. And that's how we do it here.
from? Do you actually show your bits? No, no well we've been, we've already done it. That was what we did for our audition. Yeah. Well, there's something about you that's always attractive. What's your favorite sexual position? My favorite, honestly, I like to be lying down on my back, girl up on top, but like in a doggy style position, you know, kind of with her back turned towards me, yeah. bouncing up. And, what's yours? I have two that are equally fantastic. Have you ever incorporated uh, skateboarding with sex? I think my skateboard's been on my bed when I've had sex and I've had to chuck it out of the way. But now that I'm thinking about it, I could imagine a couple great fantastic things you could do with it. What kind of men do you like? The kind that make me laugh and uh, like house music and uh, make me laugh. So are you going to go to Slam City Jam? If you can offer me free booze all day at Slam City, I'll be there. Other than that, forget it. What are we, what's going on here? Basically, we're taking this thing, and, and uh, these girls are coming in and interviewing everybody. This is a sham. Complete sham. You're exploiting the way that skaters and snowboarders live in the world today just because they're horny. My girlfriend, Nikki, has a problem carrying on for hours and hours. Anyway, I'm finished with this interview. I don't want any more. I'll let one small close-up of you looking at my boobs and that's all. See, we're getting uncensored here tonight. I ain't crazy. He's back. It's giving me some time. <laughs> Tell those people who hate us, we love you. Oh. What was I thinking? How did I think I could even do that? Oh my head. My head. Nice trick, Oh, I Have a good night! Because he's